Oh my goodness. Is it? It is a Bob Ross paint palette. Hello everyone, it's Tiffany with Thrifting Vegas. I shop at thrift stores, estate sales, garage sales and discount stores for items I can resell for profit on online platforms like eBay, Poshmark and OfferUp. Good morning everyone. I just arrived at Goodwill and it's Saturday morning and that means that they pick a colour and everything marked with that colour label is just one dollar. I'm excited to see what they have. Let's go thrifting! So I just found out that grey tag items are one dollar and I'm really happy because it's not very busy at all. Let's see what we can find. Oh look, it's a Pier 1 Cow Creamer. These are great. They sell really well. Just make sure he doesn't have any chips or cracks. He's even got his tag in the cart. No. Oh, this is a little onyx egg. These sell really well for me. People that um, make little nests love them. That's a lovely color. Purple, 69 cents, I'll take that. Just wanna have a look at this little trinket box here. It's a bit lightweight, 4.99. Oh, look at this horse, he's lovely. 4.99, I'll take that, definitely. And a paperweight with their dolphins. That's lovely. I'm going to take that for $5.99 because I know that I can resell that for a profit. What are these? Oh, little butterflies. They're a bit chipped up. This is an ashtray from the Sinesta Beach Hotel. I think that's in Florida. I'm going to take that. This is a frosted glass. Santa Claus. He's interesting. He's really quite heavy. $4.99, but he's gray tag, so he's a dollar. Definitely take him. I have to show you guys this. It's almost like an appliqued wall hanging. It's huge. It has to be a couple of feet across, but it's really nicely done. Again, I wish I had an antique booth so I could take this. $14.99, that's a good price. But I'm going to leave it for somebody else. Oh, look at this. It's a wood bowl with a sort of an inlay. $9.99, that's a home goods item. Unfortunately, the shell is just peeling there. I'm gonna leave that. Oh, I like this candle holder. It's like a wall sconce with beads. This is a little tile. It says vin, which is wine, I think, in French. $3.99. No, I'm gonna pass on that. What's this? Oh, it's a little planter. I like him. He's 30, oh, 35 cents on sale, but he's got a massive crack in him. Oh, look at this doll. She looks really old. The detail's amazing. She's porcelain. Oh, she's lovely. And just the detail in her face. I'm gonna get her. This bunny has been here for so long. I saw him with Danny and then I saw him again. And then he disappeared. I wonder if they put him in the back in the back for a while. This time I'm gonna grab him. One of my subscribers told me that cottontail cottages sell really well for her. I'm gonna take a look at it just to make sure it's in good condition and it doesn't have any chips or cracks or breaks. And I'm gonna um, pick it up and give it a try on eBay. Oh, look, 
so sweet a little ice cream shop it's lovely I think some of these sell better than others so definitely look up the one you find on eBay before you buy it there we go doing really well already oh my goodness look at this this is a project paint your own Christmas tree $9.99 I'm still gonna grab this because I think I can get around $50 for this at Christmas time oh, and there's another ocean paperweight how much is that oh $2.99 sold Look at this. It's a little beagle with reindeer ears. He's lovely. Southern living. I'm definitely going to grab this and put it aside for Christmas. Another couple of Christmas items. Oh, these are fantastic. Mid-century modern style reindeer. Mama and a baby. This is great. really like this train it's uh, bookends really super heavy and unfortunately they don't do too well on eBay so I'm going to leave this for somebody else I spotted this little cow at the back here oh I just noticed she's chipped that's such a shame <laughs> I really like this bottle. I like the hobnails with the crest. It's not very old, but for $1.99, I'll take it. You asked for half a cup of coffee. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, I like these flowers. They're pretty. Those other two Christmas mugs I was going to pick up are gone. That's okay, I still have a pair. It's a Charlie Brown mug, but there are so many of those listed, unfortunately. Let's see. Ooh, it's a Denver Broncos mug. I'll take that. 69 cents. Not really seeing much else here in the mugs. Ooh, these are martini vermouth glasses. They're great. They're vintage with the martini in the bottom. I'll take a set of four here. What's this? That's a soccer theme mug. That's a German. I think that might be soccer too. Hopcon. That's a beer convention, I think. These are Courvoisier. There's two. They're in good shape. 69 cents. I'll take this pair. Let's make sure they're in good shape. No chips, no cracks. Lovely. Wrigley Field shot glass. They're a bit low on the shot glasses today. Let's see if they have anything else. Can I get a layer to Is that the Remy product? Martin? Yep. Yeah. These frosted ones don't do so well. These are also Remy Martin, little flutes with the gold. I'll take those. 
I like this uh, uh, margarita glass. It's so colourful. Wish there was more than one. This is a uh, Gentleman Jack glass. Heavy bottom with a stamp. I'll take that one too. It's a pretty vase. One of my subscribers was telling me that denture tablets with warm water will clean up that residue. Live, love, and eat treats. That's so sweet. <laughs> What's this? I think that's just made to look old. Look at this. This is great. The bass player. It's quite heavy. $9.99. He's from Z Gallery. This is really sweet. A little ornate plate stand. I'll take that. Let's see. Three ninety nine? That's all right. I like it. These tin signs are quite popular. This one's really scratched though, that's a shame. I'm gonna leave that. Quite like these planters. Oh, they're really lightweight. Look at this mushroom. Now for that mushroom, I'm going to take this whole bag of fruit. Now I'm going back and uh, looking at these shelves again. Here's a really sweet little mini and tigger needle point. It's quite unique. I'm going to pick these up. I like this ashtray. I like the little stepping stone raised bumps. Not sure about the logo though. Luxor glass. These don't sell too well. There's a lot of them listed. Oh, look at these books. Vintage books do quite well for me, especially um, instructional books like these. And these are grey tags, so they're all a dollar. Anything else? Take these three. Oh my goodness. Is it? It is a Bob Ross paint palette. These are Magnolia half and hand. Yep, I'm going to pick these up. This brand does really, really well on eBay. It's um, Magnolia Joanna Gaines brand.
This is a sweet little giraffe. He's not in good shape though, unfortunately. Lots of crazing. If you're enjoying the video, it would mean the world to me if you could give it a thumbs up, drop a comment below, and subscribe to my channel with the little red button in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. Interesting. I think it's uh, a little vase. It looks like a nut and bolt. Oh no, it's a um, it's a votive candle holder. I think there were supposed to be two. I'm gonna leave that. There's two more uh, candle holders. I'm not really familiar with these and there's no mark. I love this. Fishy bowl. This is a Spagna. Really heavy. $7.99. I'll take that. These are really, really popular at Christmas. They're frosted glass, little lights, and they plug in. I'm gonna pick this up. You just can't find these closer to the holidays. I like these boxes. They're a stone with um, applied work on the top, but it's $12.99, and for some reason, they just don't sell very quickly on eBay. It's quite a mystery to me, because they're lovely. Oh, I thought this was glass and it's plastic. <laughs> I like these. Little uh, jar, brown glass. I'm gonna pick this up because they sell well for me. This looks like a modern dish trying to be Viking glass. Yes, it's quite cheaply made, I think. Some of these are, are quite good sellers on eBay. $4.99, made in India, the brass bars. Not for me though. Oh, I see a little bird, little bird tea light holder. I like him. Birds are really popular at the moment. They do really well for me. $2.99, I'll take it. I'm going back into the mugs because they're just putting some new things out. This little mermaid tail. It's really fun. I'll take this. Find a spot. Oops. Back in the metals, having a look. This is a Nambe um, serving dish. It's in a bit of a scratched up shape, but some of that brand can sell well. Same with this. I like the inlay, but it's quite scratched. This is Threshold, I think. Yeah, the condition on these isn't so good. That came from Savers. I can still see the price tag. This is Ray Dunn, really specific uh, wedding plate, I'm going to pass on that. And something like this, there's so many listed on eBay, just not worth the pick up. Oh, I like this bowl. Got a lot of wear inside though. I'm gonna leave that. Some of these corn cob holders do well for me, but you really need a set. Oh, 
that's Lennox. Oh, that's Lennox made in USA. I don't often pick up single salt and pepper shakers because they're slow movers, but I'll take that. This is a Tullamore Dew Irish whiskey bottle. I have one of these listed on eBay at the moment and it's just not moving for me, so I'm going to leave that one. This is a little Hummel Angel, little frosted candle holder. You can see the signature there, focus. MJ Hummel. I think I'm going to look this one up on eBay to see how they're doing. I really like this. It looks like a little Navajo Indian beadwork girl. $2.99. I'll take her. Little bluebird. Oh, he's really lightweight. Little angel. Nothing really special. I love these elephants. But unfortunately, as you can see, Goodwill has marked up the bottom with Sharpie. And that really destroys the resale value for me. That is such a shame. These sell quite well. And I just love the safari wildlife pattern on them. I spot a Floraline USA vase. This is so exciting. It could be the find of the day. They're usually in green, but this is a really nice ivory one. Let's see. There's the mark. It says 407 Floraline USA. It is just lovely. I love the lines. I love the shape. It's got a great weight. Here on my table is everything I brought home. It was an amazing shopping trip and I got so many lovely things. Here are the two vintage Disney needle points, Tigger and Minnie Mouse. I paid $3.99 a piece. I'm going to ask $15 to $20 a piece. Here's the little glass angel light. I plugged her in and as you can see, she works really well. She's a lovely frosted glass. I paid $4.99 and I'm going to ask $20 to $30 at Christmas time. I don't think I showed this in the video. It's a little bird necklace holder, $7.99. I'm not really sure what I'm going to ask yet. Our little uh, bunny was $1.99 and I think I'm going to put her aside until next Easter and ask $15 to $20. The little cottontail cottages, night light, I paid $4.99 and they're selling on eBay for $20 to $25. The little heavy frosted Santa Claus was $4.99 on sale for a dollar and I shall hold him for Christmas and ask $20 for him. The little brown glass canister was $1.49 and I shall ask $10 to $15 on eBay. The little hobnail bottle with the crest was $1.99 and again $15 to $20 on eBay. I loved this Floraline vase or planter. It's $3.99 and they're selling for about $35 on eBay. The double bass player from Z Gallery cost me $10. He's quite a heavyweight metal, 
really nice quality and they're selling on eBay for between 30 and $60. My three crafting books cost me a dollar each and I'm going to ask 15 to 20 on eBay. I love these mid-century modern reindeer. The large one was $3.99, the baby was $2.99 and I shall hold them for Christmas and I think I can probably get $50 for the pair. This little vintage porcelain doll caught my eye. She's really well made, very old. And if you, I need to put, I'm gonna put you down for a second and undo this. There we go. She's marked Germany on the back of her neck there. I don't know if you can see. that she's excellent quality and I'm not really sure what I'm going to ask I might auction her this is a Lennox USA single shaker I picked it up because it's very unique there are none like it listed on eBay and I just liked the shape and quality of it $1.99 I'll probably ask $20 for it this is my little Pier 1 cow creamer. I love these so much and they sell well for me. He cost me $3.99 and I shall ask $20 for him on eBay. I also love this little metal bird tea light holder. I like the colors and the weight. He was $2.99 and I shall ask $15 to $20. This was really unique. It looked very Victorian to me. An ornate little plate stand. It was $3.99. I shall ask 20 to 25. This is a lovely plate. A little beagle with reindeer ears. His name is Blitzen. He's made by Southern Living. And this is another piece I shall put aside for Christmas. And I think I can get between $30 and $50 for him. This uh, beaded doll is very interesting to me. I'm not really sure if she is um, Native American Indian or what tribe she is. I'm still doing some research. I paid $2.99 for her. This ashtray was interesting. I really liked the raised step, uh, sort of paver style on the edge. I'm not really familiar with the logo, but I'm going to do some more research. It was 99 cents. And this little heart purple dish, uh, I love the color, 69 cents. I should probably ask 10 to 15. Sinesta Beach Hotel ashtray. Sometimes people will pick up ashtrays to bring back a memory of a place they visited. Maybe they got married there. Maybe they had a great vacation there. But for $1.49, I'll ask $15 to $20 on eBay. I really like these glass paperweights with the fish and coral motif. They sell well for me on eBay. There's this one and the one with the dolphins in it. This one was $2.99. This dolphin one, I believe, was a little more $5.99. This one has the bubbles and what looks like uh, either coral or ocean waves. I think I can ask 20 to 25 a piece. Here's my Onyx egg. It was $1.99. These sell really well for me on eBay. 
Sometimes I'll group them together and people like to buy them and put them in nests on display. These are Magnolia half in hand. Collaboration between Target and uh, Fixer Uppers Joanna Gaines. This brand sells really well on eBay. I love that I found two of these and this little single. I think this is meant to hold a sponge on the side of the dish, uh, the sink. I was so excited to see this uh, hobbyist Christmas tree. This was a fantastic find. It was $9.99, but closer to Christmas, I think I can get $50 to $60 for it. It's vintage from 1998. This is a uh, IKEA collaboration piece. Really nice, streamlined, modern glass pitcher. $2.99. I can get between $20 and $25. Here's my Bob Ross paint palette. If you can believe it, these sell for about $25 to $30 at the moment and probably more closer to Halloween. So much fun. I love this fish dish by Espana. It's really nice quality, very heavy. It was originally sold at Macy's. I paid $7.99. I think I can get about $50 for it. This is the little mermaid tail mug I picked up. Mermaids are really popular at the moment. It was 69 cents. I think I can ask 20 to 25. These are my Courvoisier glasses. I got two of them. They're in nice condition, no chips, no cracks. I paid 69 cents a piece. I think I can get 30 for the pair. I got four of these Martini Vermouth Vintage uh, glasses. They have Martini in the bottom there. They're really popular with collectors. I can probably get 40 for the set. And this is a Gentleman Jack glass. It's a heavy bottom. Again, really nice quality. 69 cents. I'll probably ask 20 for that. I loved this margarita glass. I wish there was more of them. I would love to have a set for myself. I'm going to hold it for a while because sometimes Goodwill brings out more when they find them in the back. So fingers crossed. And last but not least, my bag of fruit, which I purchased just for this mushroom. Mushrooms are really, really trending at the moment. So I shall sell the mushroom on its own and the fruit together as another lot. 2 dollars for the bag. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my big shopping trip and my haul. And I'll see you next time. Bye.